Now one big advantage of buying the Oracle Vector Grill is that you don't need to replace any of the lighting on the front because it all comes in your grill. There's a lot of people that are replacing the headlights, the turn signals, everything up front to give a more modern look, but those can be pretty expensive, especially if you go with the Mopar LEDs. And with this, you get to replace the entire unit, plus you can customize it and make it your own. Now the low beams on this feature 5,600 raw lumens, while the high beams feature 7,200 lumens. So when you have everything together here, you're looking at over 12,000 lumens on the front end. Which I gotta tell you guys is much more than any factory or most of the LED lights that we install. Now with this grill, it does still give you the seven slots in the front. They're a little bit more narrow and it gives you a brow up top. So it definitely is a unique styling point. And if you are gonna install this, you do have to take the weather stripping and the rubber seal off the top from your original grill and install it onto here to put it on. So just a word of advice in case you were planning on selling that, you do need to take some pieces off to make sure this works. But with that being said guys, we hope this was a good description of what this grill looks like and we hope you'll stay tuned until we actually install this onto our Jeep. We have some really big plans for it and we hope you guys are excited for that as well. And if you wanna check out this grill and buy one for yourself, be sure to visit cjponyparts.com.